Look, Beep, it's the robot repair girl. She must be here to dance with her friends. Forget it, Glitch. I'm not a robot. You can't hack me like everyone else. I know. That's why I made this. Especially for you. Uh-oh. Molly! <gasps> oh, no! At last. Everyone in Robotopolis is dancing the robot. And from this day forward, you'll all be dancing it forever! <laughs> Robo Puppy, get that controller! Beep! Activate the Robo Laser Beams now! <laughs> <laughs> There's no way you're getting to my hacking controller now. You can do it, Robo Puppy. Activate dance mode. Go, Robo Puppy! All right. Cool. What's he doing? There's moves. There's so. So, you took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> yeah! Nice oh. moves! No! No! <laughs> no! Great job, Robo Puppy! Oh, you did it! <laughs> I knew you could do it, Robo Puppy. What would you like to do if you visited an island? That sounds like fun. Let's think some more about islands. Islands are an area of land that are completely surrounded by... Water. Correct. On tropical island beaches, we can find sand and... Seashells. Yup, seashells. And when you're on an island beach, it's fun to go... Swimming. That's right. Islands are awesome. Let's think about them. There's so much life on an island. We have whales and the dolphins dive in. And we'll dance on the sand as music plays. Some are sunny and it's always summer. Some half winter snow we cover. But each one's surrounded by blue waves. Island life, say hello to the ocean. Island life, watching nature in motion. Surrounded by a sea of light. trees, Gilly. They're giant stalks of broccoli. This must be our first magical stop. Who dares to enter my broccoli forest? When Molly, Gil, and Bubble Puppy entered the broccoli forest, they were stopped by a loud voice that asked, Who dares to enter my broccoli forest? Um, hi. I'm Molly, and this is Gil. We're holiday cooks. 
And we're always looking... To share our cooking? <laughs> oh, is that all? I'll be right down. Hi, I'm Ranger Gobi, guardian of the broccoli forest. Happy Harvest Day. Happy Harvest Day. We're looking for a golden tomato to make our Harvest Day stew. Can you help us find it? I can show you the way. All right. Sweet. But first, you must solve my riddle. Sure. Okay. What vegetable can you put in a salad that's green and looks like leaves? Hmm. We need your help. We're looking for a green vegetable that goes in a salad. Which one of these vegetables is green and looks like leaves? The peas, the carrots, or the spinach? That one! The spinach! Yep! Spinach is green and looks like leaves. Thanks for your help! The answer to the riddle is spinach! You got it! Mm. If you had a robot, what would your robot do? Oh, that's great! Let's think some more about robots. Some robots can carry things for us, like a... Box! A box, right. And some robots are made to clean the... Floor! Yup, the floor. And some robots can even explore outer... Space! That's right! Beep, boop, beep. Robots are everywhere. Let's sing about them. Now you may think they're from a future time, like you'd see in a space age book. But you can find them all around today, if you just know where to look. At home or school, they get things done. Doing whatever they're programmed to do. If we had no bots, we sure would miss the incredible work they do. They can build a car, or vacuum the floor, or deliver a package to your front door. Or buy new planets to explore. Robots do it all on their own. They're such amazing machines. Robots. Robots, you can ask one to dance if it was built to bust a move. Cause they do whatever they're programmed to do. You know, we really do make a good team. Teamwork makes the dream work. Yeah! Tiny wanted to turn Zippy City the opposite of fast. So he had us slime to the wall to slow us down. Well, this is a sticky situation. We'll never get out of here in time to save Zippy City. Bubble Puppy! That's it! Oh. Oof. Oof. Thanks, boy! Now come on, let's go! But how are we gonna stop them? I have an idea, but we need to move the opposite of slow. Real fast! <laughs> if we change the street signs to the opposite direction, we can trick Tiny Creeper and Crawler into going the wrong way. Ha! <laughs> Good opposite thinking. Ooh. 
Not so zippy now. Nice one, <laughs> boss. <laughs> Look, now's our chance. <laughs> <laughs> Like we're going the wrong way. <laughs> Hurry, they're coming. <laughs> Whoa, wait a minute. We already slammed this street. Now we're stuck in it. Well. You gotta be kidding. Give it up, Tiny. Your slime spree is over. You too, Opposites crew. Back to snail jail again? Ah, rats. So that's why they're not all in the same tank. They like to live in different parts of the ocean. Exactly. And the ocean is made up of many different habitats. A habitat is a place where an animal lives. That's right, Nani. Let's think about some of the different places we can find in the ocean. A tide pool is a place where we can find... Starfish! Yup. And a warm, sunny reef is where we can find... Coral. Right. Coral can be bright colors, like orange or red or pink. And down near the bottom of the ocean floor, we can find... Jellyfish. Yes, and it's so dark down there, they have to make their own light. The ocean is full of cool habitats. Let's sing about it. At the beach, you might see tide pools, water in the sand. Those little coves make perfect homes for starfish, mussels, and clams. Then head out past the waves, where you'll find the coral reef. A million fish swim in and out, bright colors you won't believe. But coral's very fragile, yet actually alive. So look, don't touch, as you snorkel on by. There's a world to explore underneath the sea. Oh, so many habitats, whether shallow or deep. For the plants and animals, it's the place to be. There's a world to explore underneath the sea. Fish looking for shelter, then the seaweed might help. At the bottom of the ocean lies the midnight zone. It's hidden far away from light, so the fish make their own. The fish make their own. But we're going to need your help. 
The Titans have colds, and it's making them sneeze a lot. What should they use for their sneezes? That one! The tissues! Right! They can cover their noses with the tissue so they don't spread germs. Colds also make you feel yucky, but eating something can sometimes help with that. Which one of these can you eat? That one! The soup! Right! This soup and the tissue should make the Titans feel better. Thanks for your help! Wow! I do feel a bit better! And our weather powers are back! What about you? Would you like to climb up a mountain? I see. Let's think some more about mountains. Mountains are very tall parts of land that rise up into the sky. Some of them even have... Snow. That's right. And the top of a mountain is called the peak. And an animal with hooves that's good at climbing up steep cliffs is called a mountain... Goat. Yup, a mountain goat. And a furry animal that lives up in the mountains is a snow... Monkey. That's right. Snow monkeys sit in hot springs to stay warm. Mountains have such cool stuff. Let's think about that. Hike up the mountainside, let's explore terrains and climates. Getting cooler and cooler along the way. Hey, hey, hey. Trees turning to pines. The higher we climb, can't wait to see what we'll find. Step by step till we reach the top. Climb the mountain with me. Sheep and mountain goats, those animals up high have a different view. Soon we'll be eye to eye with the eagles that fly, and we're touching the sky. Step by step till we reach the top, climb the mountain with me. Up, 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 cause mountains rock. Sure was. Now where are we? Uh, a little help here? Molly? Goby? <laughs> Thanks. What were you two doing up there? I think someone's been setting booby traps. And I think I know who. Really? Who? Hey, my hat! Wait, what? studying gorillas for a long time. You're supposed to be gentle, shy, and nice. Or not. Run! Now hold on a sec. Whoa! Whoa! How do we get across? Everyone grab a vine and swing! Help! 
just a little marmoset monkey? Um, I really could use some help. Don't worry, little guy. We'll save you. Hang on. Uh. Thanks. <sighs> You're welcome. Which animal on the savanna would you like to see? Oh, me too. Let's think some more about African savannas. African savannas are known for being covered in tall... Grass. Right. They're covered in grass that animals like to eat. And the African savanna also has lots of spread out... Trees. Yup. Tall animals like giraffes like to eat leaves from the trees. The African savanna is home to the biggest land animal in the world, the mighty... Elephant! That's right! Savannas are wild! Let's sing about them! Where the grass is tall and trees face wide, cheetahs race, hyenas cry, where rhinos charge and egrets fly, giraffes so tall they touch the sky. Where lions hunt and leopards run, elephants laze warm by the sun. Impalas sleep and hippos wade, the wind picks up and grass is sway. Savannah, savannah, oh wild savannah, where animals roam, their African home. While baboons do their baboon dance And warthogs with their mighty tusks Roam the plains from dawn to dusk the mighty limbs of baobab trees Shade roaming herds of wildebeest And over at the watering hole A zebra mom drinks with her foal Get this recipe. <laughs> Hang on tight. They're right behind us. <laughs> Look out. Meteors. Tell you, piece of cake. Greetings, space travelers, and welcome to our Meteor Mini Mart. We may be small, but we got it all. So, what can we help you with? We need ingredients to make secret moon muffins. I think we have these ingredients. But we're going to need your help. To make this recipe, we need two eggs, Martian spice, and three bananas. Which card has three bananas? That card! The green one! That's right! Thanks for your help. You should have everything you need for the recipe. Thanks! Good luck making the secret moon muffins. What would you use solar power for? Nice. Let's think some more about solar power. 
Solar power is energy from the... Sun! That's right! The sun's rays are a great source of energy. You can use solar power to turn on all the things that need power in your... House! Yup, and we can use solar power anytime because its energy can be stored inside a... Battery! That's right! Who knew the sun had so much... Power! <laughs> Let's sing about it! When the sun is high in the clear blue sky The light comes shining on down A solar panel array is soaking up those rays And sending power all over the town To the lights in your house, every kitchen appliance Toys and gadgets, it's all been the science of solar power how the sun, the sunny sun, gives solar power to you and me. It's shining down on everyone and making electricity from the sun, the sunny sun. Yeah, it's natural energy. With the right kind of car, you can drive near or far without a gallon of gasoline. And it's healthy to boot, there's no need to pollute. You know that solar is nice and clean. So clean. Kept in batteries for when there's no light. Like a cloudy day or the middle of the night. Yeah, it's solar power. That's how the sun, the sunny sun, gives solar power to you and me. It's shining down on everyone and making electricity from the Rang, princess? What's wrong? I can't sleep. I'm way too excited. That's why your bedtime routine... If I don't get to sleep, I'll be cranky for my party tomorrow. Nobody likes a cranky queen. Well, I think you just need to... Call our magical fairies? That's exactly what I was thinking. You clapped for us, Princess Dima? <sighs> We're here to... <laughs> Help! Hello! I need your help falling asleep, guys. Hmm. How about some fairy dust? I'll toss some of our special snoozy dust over you. And I'll wave my wand and poof! Sleepy time! Sounds dreamy. But don't you think... I have my wand, right? Hmm. <gasps> Uh-oh! It's broken! Oops. Now what are we going to do? We need to repair my wand. But we're going to need your help. We have to put the pieces back together. Let's start at the bottom. Which piece goes here? The long one. The rectangle. That's right, the long rectangle. Now which piece goes here? Yeah! Right! The short rectangle. Now let's put together the star. Which piece goes here? That one! Right there! Yes! And that means this piece goes here. Thanks for fixing my wand. All set. First, some snoozy dust. Abracadabra! What's your favorite food? Oh, that one's yummy. Let's think some more about the five food groups. Proteins are foods that make your muscles strong, like chicken, steak, and... Eggs. Right. And beans and tofu are protein, too. Grains are foods that give you energy, like... 
<laughs> yep. And foods that come from milk are called dairy, like yogurt, ice cream, and... Cheese. Dairy nice. <laughs> the five food groups are making me hungry. Let's sing about it. Let's have a feast with our friends and family. The food is made past your plate. Who's hungry? Different kinds make a variety. It takes more than one food to make more than one stew to nourish and feed you what you need to grow. There are Bubble puppy. <laughs> the guppies, Baby Shark, and William were on their way to the Arctic Ocean when salty old Captain A Crab caught up to them. Maybe we can lose Captain Eight Crab in there. When something is murky, it's cloudy and muddy and hard to see through. Oh, I know where we are. It's the Murky Triangle. The Murky Triangle? Legend has it that subs go in there and never come out. Uh, <laughs> hate to rush you, but Captain Eight Crab is getting pretty close. <laughs> Gil, we have no choice. It's our best chance to lose them. Ah, shrimp toast. We lost them. Let's think about how we make yummy food. The room where we cook and bake is called the... Kitchen. Right. And you can mix ingredients together with a... That's right. And when you're learning to cook something, you follow a... Recipe. Yup, a recipe tells you what foods you need and what steps to take. Now we're cooking? Yeah, let's sing about it. Fruits, veggies, grains, nuts, dairy, and more. Get it from the farm or the grocery store. Then step by step, pretty soon you'll see. We're making a kitchen masterpiece. Oh, whoa, let's cook some food and add the ingredients one by one. Oh, whoa, let's cook some food. The recipe tells you how it's done. I want to chop it, bake it, fry it. It's a tasty treat. Yeah, I can't wait to try it. Come on, let's Tasty. 
gonna cross this. Too bad ninjas can't fly. I guess ninjas can fly. Hello, I'm Mountain Ninja Nani. And I'm Mountain Ninja Molly. Hi, we're on a mission to take Moshi here back home to his troop. The only problem is they live way up there. Moshi! He thinks he's a ninja. <laughs> Maybe we can help. With these wingsuits, we can all fly across to the other side. But we better hurry. The storm is coming. <laughs> and so, with everyone wearing a wingsuit, they were set to fly across to Moshi's home. But the storm was getting closer. We have to hurry. It's getting really windy. All set, Moshi? Moshi! Ready? Nice work, ninjas. Thanks for your help. Ninjas always help other ninjas. <laughs> Here you go. Thanks. If you follow that trail, it will take you over the ridge and right to Moshi's home. Good luck, ninjas. Thanks for your help. What's your favorite pet? Oh, that's a good one. Let's think some more about pets. Pets get hungry, just like us. So to take good care of them, you need to give them plenty of... Food! Right! It's important to give pets food and water every day. It's also important to keep your pet clean, like giving your dog a... Bath! Yup! Lots of pets love getting clean. There are many different animals that make great pets, like dogs, cats, and... Birds. Yes, birds make excellent pets. My favorite pet is a dog. <laughs> Let's sing about dogs. They go for walks, guard and protect. They run around, bark and wag their tails. Whoa! Arr, arr, arr. You can teach them lots of tricks. Roll over and fetch a stick. They've got a super sense of smell. Whoa! Arr, arr, arr. Dogs perform many roles. Hunt and herd pull heavy loads. Look around there everywhere you go. A puppy So we headed right over. Say, what are you detectives doing in my ice cream joint? We're on a case, ma'am. Looking for these snails. Have you seen them? 
creeper and crawler. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. They were just here. Say, what's the holdup? Isn't this the fastest ice cream joint in town? What's taking our Sunday so long? Yeah, we ordered them a whole minute ago. This is so slow. That's the opposite of fast. Another opposite? All right, everyone, hold your horse feathers. I'll get to the bottom of this and have your Sundays out here lickety split. Say, Chef Una, what's the holdup? We got a load of shellfish out front ready to flip their wigs. Not in a good way. I'll tell you what's wrong, boss. Look at this. Ooh, gross. Yeah. The freezer usually keeps the ice cream frozen. But now it's all melted. <gasps> frozen and melted. Another opposite. <laughs> well, we can't serve melted ice cream. No wonder we're slow today. Let's take a closer look. <sighs> Yuck. Yuck. This has been slime too. And look. The temperature is set to hot. We need to fix it, but we're gonna need your help. To freeze the ice cream again, we've gotta find the right temperature to set the freezer to. Right now, it's set to hot, but we need it to be the opposite of hot. Is this the opposite of hot? No, that's red. Wet is not the opposite of hot, so let's keep going. Is this the opposite of hot? Yes, that's cold! Right! Cold is the opposite of hot. Thanks for your help! Hey, thanks! The ice cream is getting cold again! Happy Halloween! I love your pirate costume. Arg! It's not a costume. What? <gasps> hey! I can't eat silver coins. Unless they're filled with chocolate? Ha <laughs> ha! They're not! <laughs> Arg! <gasps> oh no! Arg! <laughs> Great pirate costume. It's not a costume. Arrgh. My pumpkins! And your whole town, too. <laughs> Shiver me timbers, ye scallywag. <gasps> Did I just say scallywag? I don't even know what that means. <gasps> Right there, pirate. Yar, <laughs> you're too late, me hearties. We're all pirates here now. <laughs> Gilly, we have to get the holiday wizard's magic wand back before she turns every holiday town into a pirate town. And we won't get to celebrate any other holidays. Quit flapping your jaws and go after her, mateys. Sorry. I'm usually much more polite. Look! We almost have her! <laughs> Whoa! I can't see where we're going! Hold on! web decoration. <laughs> Good save. Our pleasure. What about you? What instrument do you want to play? Oh, I love that one, too. Let's think some more about music. You can make music with instruments, like a... Guitar. Right. And some instruments have keys that play different notes, like a... Piano. 
Yup, each piano key makes a different sound. You can also use your voice to make music when you... Sing! That's right. It's fun to sing along to your favorite song. I love music. Let's sing about it. Let's make music now. Pass the instruments around. Guitars, drums, or bass, a piano to play. Each one makes a special sound. These sounds and tones are notes. Making patterns in a row. You'll find a song that's all your own. Everyone can make music. Play along, you can do it. It's time to share your voice and there's a song for everyone. Sing, clap. Goldfinger's lair to get back their ultra spy tool. But they were caught and frozen in blocks of ice. Let's go ice. Let's get cold. Let's make things that are icy cold. Yeah. Give it back, Dr. Coldfinger. Oh, sorry, but I need your ultra spy tool to hammer the humongous nails into my ice beamer 3000. So exciting. <laughs> uh. Anyways, ah, uh, yes. Now, let's see here. <gasps> A giant hammer! Very good for hammering. Swipe Good idea. Try to break the ice. You did it, Spy Pop! <clears throat> Oops! Oops. <laughs> Freeze! I don't think so! Oopsies. Nice work, Secret Agent Molly. Thanks! Hand it over, Cold Finger. Huh? But, 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 but you were frozen in ice! Claws! Oddlob, catch! <laughs> I got it, boss! Uh-oh, <laughs> boss, catch! No! Spy save! Woo! Nice save, Agent Goby. Thanks, Agent Molly. <laughs> My master plan is ruined. How will I ever finish building my giant ice cream machine now? Huh? That's not a giant freeze ray? A giant what now? No! I just wanted to build the greatest ice cream machine in the world! So everyone could enjoy Cold Fingers' famous frosty ice cream. <gasps> my hench lobsters love it. Yeah. It's so yummy. That mint chip did look pretty good. I'm sorry I took your ultra spy tool. If all you wanted to do was build an ice cream machine, all you had to do was ask to borrow the ultra spy tool. Really? Mm-hmm. May I please borrow it? Sure. We'll even help you build it. <laughs> <clears throat> Thank you. Done. Is your new pet an elephant? 
Judge Una and Judge Nani. We are so excited to see all these talented dogs perform. This may turn out to be our best show ever. Not if I huh? can help it. <gasps> oh no! Felina meow. My, aren't you a handsome mutt? <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> Turn my little meatball into a cat? Yep. <laughs> Meowzers! Felina has a cat ray that turns dogs into cats! That's right. I, Felina Meow, will make sure your little dog show becomes a perfectly fabulous cat show. <laughs> uh oh. But could she be stopped before she turned the dog show into a cat show? There's only one superhero team who can help us with this catastrophe. Puppy Girl and Super Pup. That's Mayor Molly's signal. Up, up, Super Pup. <laughs> Stanley, those dog show judges are going to be so impressed. Wah! It's a catastrophe! <laughs> run, buddy, run! Huh? What a talented kitty you've got. Stanley's not a kitty. He's a dog. A handsome dog. Not for long. Say meow, Stanley. Stop right there, Felina! <laughs> well, well, if it isn't the super doggy duo, Smile for my cat gray. Not so fast. Activate your supersonic bar. <laughs> oh. You may have broken my cat ray, but I have more tricks up my furry sleeve. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Go. yeah. <clears throat> I wonder what's inside. I hope it's a new bike. No. Drum set. Ooh. A big, bouncy trampoline. Ha ha! Wrong! It's the three guppeteers. And we're here to take back all of Zooey's party stuff. I don't think so. It's my party stuff now. Then let the battle begin. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> no. <laughs> uh uh. <laughs> Miss me. <laughs> now what? <gasps> Can I have a lift? We. Oui. Ha ha! <laughs> Thank you. Surrender, Monsieur Gargoyle. Well, if I can't have a party, then no one will. Boop, boop, boop. No cake for you. And no gift for you. And your stone. And your stone. And your stone. Oh, no! We've got to stop him before he turns everything to stone. Hey, stop! Don't let him touch anything else. Boop, boop, boop. Boop. Wait. I have an idea. Let's wrap this up, team. Huh? Hey, what are you doing? I can't move my arms, or my wings, or my toes. Ooh. A nice bow should finish this off. Ah. Oh, man. How about you? Can you tell me an opposite? Ooh, that's a good one. Let's think some more about opposites. The opposite of night is... Day. That's right. And the opposite of big is... Small. Yes, indeed. Another opposite is up and... Down. Precisely. Opposites are the opposite of boring. <laughs> That means they're fun. Let's sing about them. When one thing is not like the other, not just a little bit. Oh, so different from one another, that's when the fun begins. So I say up and you say down. I say smile, you say frown. Totally different, not the same. That's how you play the opposites game.